Good afternoon, Construction World. Christopher here from Oryx Equipment. Look, we're here with our 2015 Tesmic 1475. This thing's an absolute ripper. 2015 with 3,800 digging hours on it, 6,000 engine hours. Caterpillar C18, this thing is tidy. We've just got it into stock. Uh, set up to dig just a little bit over one metre wide and uh, it's in really good shape really good shape we've got to do uh we're going to go right over the whole machine from front to rear so we'll get it be into uh full job ready condition as we always do we've got a leaking uh scraper cylinder here uh there and then we've also got uh we've got to replace the uh conveyor belt as well she's worn out but while we're in there we'll also do the uh, conveyor bearings all of the return rollers uh, everything that we need to do in there any skirting rubber that we need to do we'll do all of that it's going to get a full clean um, like from top to bottom inside out back to front um, I've actually this is the first trenching machine I've ever come across that has I haven't been able to find any leaks on this machine anywhere. Not a chafed hose, nothing. Now, I've been down into the bowels of this machine. Uh, we're gonna be doing our standard um, fit out to the inside of the cab. So what does that entail? That entails, we strip the, the, the whole interior of the cab. For some reason, when they build these machines, they use some shithouse um, glue, uh, interior kind of vinyl and terrible foam. So what we'll do, we strip these out on the interior. We'll uh, install some sound deadening on all of the panels that we possibly can. We'll install sound deadening. And then we've got a, uh, a top quality foam that we use and a high quality um, uh, vinyl as well. So uh, we also will recover and refit out the whole seat. So, uh, so that'll all be overhauled, uh, of course, with our uh, MHJ equipment logo on that one as well. Uh, we'll get oil samples on every compartment on this machine as well so uh, so we always know what uh, what kind of condition all the compartments are in um, like the radiator in this this thing is absolutely spot on um, this was a really 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 good buy we've got uh, one of the coolers the condenser up there that I've just got to uh, redo all the fins on on that one someone's just uh, just touched the edges of that um, what else do we need to do to this one? Uh, I think that's about it. Apart from the, the clean inside and out, of course, we've got to go through the hard face, the whole digging chain assembly as well. So um, they kind of love to run them without any hard facing on over here. So we'll go over, we'll re-tighten every, uh, every bolt, every plate bolt on this. Uh, we'll replace any pockets that need replacing, teeth that need replacing, and so on and so forth. And then we will get going on all of the hard facing and building up any of the plates on the corners to make them tip top and uh, and all sexy. Um, all the rollers up there, I've checked all of those. They all look in uh, in great shape. And uh, and these bushes, these are just. They really are in great shape and even up into the um, all of the we'll have to replace some of the wear plates underneath down towards the front there probably even build them up maybe and uh and all of the head shaft sprockets they're in uh, they're in tip-top shape up in there as well this thing is a credit to the last owner it really really is they've uh, they've really looked after uh this one we bought two of them in a package, so uh, the other ones are 2011, and uh, and the the chain's just worn out on that one, so we'll put a new set of digging chains on it, new set of uh, digging plates as well. So yeah, 2015 uh, Tasmac 1475. If you're in the market, let us know. We'd be loved. Uh, we'd love to help you out. This is going to be for sale. This one and the 2011 that we've got coming into uh, that is in stock, I should say that one we're going to be putting out for rental so if you're looking to rent or buy let us know we've got uh, we've got a pretty good solution for you guys thanks guys until next time